What's up, everybody? What's up, OG? Hey, hey, hey. How's everybody doing? I think everybody's doing fantastic. What you got going on today, man? This is your show. I'm telling you, it is my show. It's your show. So you, do your thing. you don't even look at me. I see you in the camera. You're going to look at me. Yeah, I know. I'm not looking at you. Don't look at me either. I will I'll look at you. All right. <laughs> I'm going to make a apple foster pie, something anybody can make uh, for the holidays. It's a stupendous pie, um, something you've never tasted before. Uh, so I'm going to just jump into it. Jump right? in, bro. Jump in. All right. I'm going to peel a few apples, get this pie situated. And all these ingredients will have uh, online, so you can buy all this at your uh, local supermarket. And uh, you can make this pie fall in these directions. Shouldn't have any problem. And your relatives or whoever you give the pie to will be amazed because it is a magnificent pie. First, I'm going to slice some apples. Afterwards, I'm going to saute and flambe them. Going to saute and flambe the apples. Saute and flambe. Yo, I'm, I'm, react, I'm sitting here reacting to you. You're doing your thing, man. It's going to be magnificent. I'm telling you, it's going to be magnificent. When did you learn to make this? How did you learn? When did you learn? When this happened? I've been baking about 40 years. Um, I have a large family. So on the holidays, I would go visit my family. We would have like reunions, and everyone wanted me to make something. Uh, and. Uh, Every now and then, I wasn't prepared, but I had to uh, do the best I could with the resources I had, and uh, I was able, the outcome was uh, pretty good. Family's kind of hard on you when you're baking or cooking, so you really got to put your best foot forward because they're not really complimentary of you when you're doing things like this, so you got to believe in what you're doing and the end result makes everybody feel like, okay, he knows what he's doing. And I do. So, like I said, I'm just slicing up a few apples. This uh, pie takes about four or five apples. Slice. You want about a half cup of uh, cinnamon sugar. How long have you been doing this? Bacon. I, I'm, I'm on this pie or bacon? How long have you been bacon? 40 years. 40 long years. 40 years. Yes. Damn, man, you've been sticking to it, man. Yeah, I could do this in my sleep. In your sleep? Yeah, I could do this in my sleep. When did you realize you could do this in your sleep? You know what? Probably after like uh, maybe 10 years. Because I, you know, I did a little bit of everything. Baking, bread, organic breads, European pastries, cakes, cakes uh, wedding cakes. Wedding cakes. Um, just about a little bit of everything. Hmm. So then you start to develop a type of uh, skill, that, skill that, you know, my family would give me walnuts, like walnuts strawberries, strawberries, whatever, whatever. and I would have to make uh, something for them, and I, I never failed to satisfy. So it just came second nature, very easy for me. And like, hey, and, uh, well, so and somebody watching from Tokyo, Che, watching from Tokyo. Tokyo, oh, man. Tokyo, oh, man. Tokyo, make this pie, man. 40 years of baking, you're a professional. From a hey, you got to run in the chat. Slice these apples. apples. Am I pronouncing the name right? She, XG. Hey, she likes XG, OG. Oh, she likes XG. Oh, XG, those my girl. Who's your favorite? Jury. Why she your favorite? Yeah. You know why she's my favorite? She got such pizzazz, such a style. I'm gonna mix a little uh, sugar and cinnamon. Make a little cinnamon sugar. Cinnamon sugar. Yeah, uh, Jura is my favorite. And you know, before <clears throat> I watched on the reaction, never, never heard of the group, never knew, probably never would have uh, listened to that. Um, but actually, I have heard some of their work, but I did not know it was that. A little cinnamon sugar, like a quarter cup. Let me take you off here, bro. Oh, there I'm running. I'm running the show in the background. Also, a quarter cup of uh, butter. Oh, 
put a cup of butter. Do your thing. Now we're ready to saute it on the stove. Are you ready to saute on the stove? Yeah. All right, all right. We got you ready for the stove. It doesn't matter what apples you use, any kind of apples. Pretty good. Flavor speaks for itself. I don't want to capture you doing that. Everybody on the stove. All right, so we got apples. Apples, cinnamon, sugar, butter. Put it around you. So now you want to saute in about uh, maybe like five minutes. Add a little brandy. Yay, 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 yay. A little bit more for the brothers who ain't here. Ooh. That was all? That was it? You want to know what you're cooking? So what are you cooking? You want to know what you're cooking? I'm cooking uh, apple, cinnamon, sugar, and butter. You put a little brandy to flavor it. And what are you making? What are you making? I'm making an apple foster pie. Apple foster pie. Yeah, this is perfect for the holidays. Tell you, <clears throat> I, I see you over here holding the skillet without yeah. no gloves, bro. No, you don't need it. You don't need it. Yeah. <laughs> That's a straight metal. He's not going. He has no gloves. People, please wear gloves. Do oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't try this at home, kids. You got to at least be a seasoned professional. See, that's starting to cook saute up. You want to give it about five minutes? As you can see, it's starting to sizzle a little bit. Take your time. Oh, yeah, you smell that? I smell that. You don't want to cook down too much, just a little bit. Also, you want to preset your oven to 340 degrees Fahrenheit. She says she want to try some. It's cooking up perfectly. Exactly how you want it. Tease it a little bit. That's right, pimping ain't easy. <laughs> Just another couple of minutes. See, now you want to add a little Bacardi 151. Oh, yeah, that's what we want. And now the secret ingredient. Secret ingredient, you want to add a cup of the uh, yellow cake mix. Oh man. It's about a cup. You know what I'm talking about. Cut the fire off. Steer. Can y'all smell that? Y'all can't smell it yet. This guy is over here killing it, dog. Let's get more. Let's get more of that pan. A little more cake mix. There you go. Beautiful, beautiful. Good shot. Good shot, guys. Look at that right there. He's put yellow cake mix in it. Yellow cake mix, secret ingredient. You don't need pectin, cornstarch, none of that. Ah. Hey, so we got some chi. I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. She says, recently, one of my fun things to do is to watch you guys' reaction videos. Today's one, fish also good. Okay, thank you so much, man. We doing our thing, she. So what are we doing now? Okay, next, you place it in a pie shell. Hmm. Arigato. Arigato. Okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna bring it over here. Use a little egg wash, brush the sides. And then you want to take, take the second pie shell. shell. You want to use strips to cover the top of the cake, makes it a lot easier. I want some. Hi, you want some? Yo, you should come through. Yo, Soul Sister TV, extremely extra. Get ready to get on the show with us, girl. Get ready. So he used the other pie to make the strips on the top of the pie. To make the strips on top of the pie. Thank you, Che. You pronounce my name okay. It is a little difficult to pronounce. Let me put it up there. It is for Westerners, though. Sisa, Chi, very Japanese name. I bet. Got people in the comments. So, Sister TV, she said, nice. You see it? You see the strips? <laughs> you see, he put the strips on. OG's pastries. And that's all the strips? That's it? That's the strip, but it's a little, little bit more to it. Uh-oh. This is an ordinary pie shell you could get at your local supermarket. He made us go back to the supermarket to go get the pie <laughs> shell because he first told me, Santi, go get some pie crust. I said, all right, I went and got pie crust, the ones that they sell in the aisle. He's like, yo, they got pie crust in the in the frozen food section. Mm. What I'm doing now is just making a couple of leaves for the. Uh... <laughs> Chase says, "I know making pie is difficult. Is it difficult, OG, to make pies?" No, it's simple. It's easy. I mean, look how long it took me to do this. You could do the same thing. It's not going to take that long. It's sexy. Look at that. Look at what that guy's doing. That's skills. That is skill. That's what that is. Okay. You want to use your <laughs> egg wash again? Use the egg Lightly wash. Brush. Oh, yeah. Wow, look at that. That's crazy. That's crazy how this guy just works that magic. Last but not least, dust it with your cinnamon sugar. Dusting it with cinnamon sugar. Light out. Bang. All right. Put it in the oven. All right. There you go. That is beautiful. That is beautiful. Apple Look at this. Pie. That is beautiful. Preheat the oven 340 for about 25 the 30 minutes should be ready. Drop it in on it. Let's put it in the oven, OG. How long are we leaving that in there? About 25 minutes. Okay, somebody had a question for you, OG. Let yeah, me, what's uh, the question? What is the difference between a normal apple pie and your foster pie? So the foster pie, as you see, yeah, is sauteed with the brandy. The foster pie is sauteed with brandy. Speaking to the microphone there. Oh, okay. Tell them there. The, the apple foster pie sauteed with like a brandy and butter, cinnamon sugar, and then it's uh, flambéed with a Bacardi 151 to give it like a lot more flavor. It makes the flavor pop. No more apple pie is just apple, cinnamon sugar, or brown sugar. You know, so this does something to spice it up a bit. The flavor is phenomenal. So if you make this pie, you won't believe how great. The people who taste the pie won't believe that you made it. So talk to me more about the pie while we weigh in. So at this time you just sit back and you just kick it. You don't even you don't even really check it normally. I know I know we ask you to check it, but normally you don't check it. Not really. I mean the pie's not going anywhere. Mm -hmm. 25, 30 minutes is good. You know, you don't have to be exact. But when, when the pie is ready, you'll know it. And we got ice cream too. Oh, okay. What kind of ice cream do you normally say you get for that? You get with that? Beer flavored. Beer flavored ice cream. Yeah, it's new. <laughs> <laughs> what? 
No, I normally eat it with like a like a heavy cream, heavy whipping cream. Like whipped cream. Okay. Just a whipped cream, that's it, not ice cream. Yeah, I like it warm. Mm. So the ice cream really doesn't do it for me. Mm. The whipped cream complements because it's light mm, with a hint of mint. Mm. Can't go wrong. Now you won't make me want to check it. Yeah, check it, man. I don't. I don't want to make you not. I don't want you to to burn your ice cream. I mean, oh, it's, not, not, it's not. Oh my goodness! It looks that good. It wow. smells amazing. Can you smell it? Of course, I can smell. It smells amazing. Ten minutes tops. It'll be ready. In ten more minutes, and that's it. So how long? Class fit for king. How long do you it to take to make this pie? Excuse me. How long does it take to make it? It took about 15 minutes total. Preparation time, cutting, sauteing, uh, making the decoration, about 15 minutes. You did that so effortlessly, though. Yeah, it's an easy, very easy. Look at what I did, do it. You don't have to have a great amount of skill to do it. You know, I know you're going to enjoy it. Whoever eats the pie is going to enjoy it more than you. And they're going to ask you, oh my God, where did you get it from? Just try it. Can't go wrong. <laughs> Wait a minute. Like and subscribe. Oh, yeah. Everyone says I say it too, too fast. Like, Slow motion for you. Comment and subscribe. Thank you so much. Oh, gee. That pie is smelling amazing. Can, can you bro. smell the pie? Dude, I smelled the heck out of that pie. Me. That pie smells phenomenal. Oh, the pie is about one minute from being ready. Wow. One minute from being ready. And how you know, and how you know it's only a minute? Because you said 15 before. And now you're saying it's going to be a minute. Well, <clears throat> I go by 15. Please explain. Color people time. Color people time. But don't that mean you be late? I guess you're right. <laughs> you know how you say you go on a break? Yeah. How long are you going to be going? i just be going a minute. Yeah, so I go by that. Word, word. But yeah, the pie. <clears throat> I say, honestly, it's about two minutes from being perfect. So we got to keep Dude, going. I had a great time doing this also. We got to do it again. I got millions of recipes, millions of pastries. Anybody have any requests, throw them out there. If I like it, I'll see you Apple pie is coming out. Apple pie is coming out now? Yes. He's about to get the apple pie out, guys. There goes the finished product. Ciao, Bella. Ciao, Bella. And now... Nobody from Italy watching? Nobody from Italy so far that oh. I know. Anybody from Italy out here? Chabella? Chabella. I speak a little Italian. Italiano, Italiano. Yeah. So how long do we wait for that to cool off before we uh, slice it and uh, put some ice cream on it? I would say, <laughs> um, depending on how hot you like a pie, I would give it like maybe 10, 15 minutes. 10, 15 minutes. Yeah. You got look, not it's supposed to look like an apple. But it's supposed to look like an apple. It oh. does look like an it apple. Like an it has brown sugar sprinkles on the top of the pie. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's cinnamon sugar. Cinnamon too. Whatever. Yeah. It is okay. I stand corrected. It's cinnamon sugar, everybody. Mm -hmm. We're gonna slice the pie, put some ice cream on it, and we're gonna eat that, and then we're gonna get the heck up out of here. We thank you, everybody, everybody in Japan that's been rolling with us, Soul Sister TV, Kwana, our other co-host, she's going to be Kwana. as well. Uh, shout out to our beautiful uh, staff member here. This is OG's Pastries. But, yo, now we're about to slice this pie and slap some ice cream on it, 
and we're going to taste this pie, and then we're going to head out of here. Thank you, everybody that's been liking, commenting, and subscribing. Thank you, everyone. Shout out Chi. Shout out uh, Chi. Shout out Chi. Once again, shout out Chi out there in oh, Japan. Shit. Shout out Soul Sister TV. Extremely extra. She's going to be on the show as well with us at times. So, yeah, we're looking at you slice that pie, my brother. Hmm. Mm. Look at the slice. Look at the slice. Can we get a first tasting? Can I get a, I mean, can I get a spoon? Yes. Can I, ooh, and they got those. Um, would you like the, a drizzle of the um, libations on top? Uh, no, I'll take some libations in the glass, though. Look at okay. that. Look at that. You can see the brown sugar. Ice cream. Oh, cinnamon sugar. Dang, cinnamon. You can see the cinnamon <laughs> sugar. Okay, OG. You know, just at the same time. OG, I'm waiting for you, man. Who? This is tough. <laughs> this, this looks so. I need to take a photo of that thing. On the count of three. Okay. One, two, three. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, that's crazy, bro. I like the texture. Oh, man. Normally, I don't like when I can taste the slice of the pie. But because of the, the brandy, mm. it made the pot of apple taste even better. Mm. And then the cinnamon sugar, <laughs> the cinnamon sugar. Yo, this is crazy. Mm. Killed it. Killed it. Hey, thank everybody for tuning in, liking, commenting, subscribing. Oh, do you tell them everything? Tell them what's up. Tell them. I, I should end this. You should end this. You should tell them. Like and subscribe. Let us know if you want the recipe. We can give them the recipe, right? I can put it in the description. Yeah, you can put the recipe in the subscription. In the description. Hey, thank you guys for letting me show some of what I know. And uh, hopefully you'll make this, you know, over the holiday. You'll like it. And look forward to me doing more recipes and more pastries in the future. So I thank everyone. And Until also, next time. Until next time. And also tune in to us. We have a podcast called All Gas, No Break Podcast. Me and OG. Uh Check out our Instagram at A G N B D M V. Alpha George Nancy Bravo DC Maryland Virginia. Alpha George Nancy Bravo DC Maryland and Virginia. Also, mm -hmm. like, comment, subscribe, and share this with a million friends. Yeah, do it. Million and a half. A peace. Peace.